Hi guys, my name is Muhammad Shahzad Arshad and today we are going to start another scanning video. It's a series of the previous chain. So today we will uh, scan with the Nasus a domain controller server which is uh, 2012 server uh, R2 and uh, we are going to scan this one. So let's go on vCenter. I would like to show you my vCenter. Here is and this is the second domain controller. It is a Windows 2012 server and we have IP address 100.102. So I will go on this server and I can show you the it's a domain controller. See the active directory. There you go. So see the DC2 is also a domain controller. And if we go on this server, the local name of this server is DC2, which is my scanry domain controller so this is 2012 server as well so we'll go for local and check it's a dc2 and home dot local and the 100.102 so let's go and scan this guy and uh with our uh, nasus scanner i will go on my nasus here we go and here i will make a new new folder which is windows 2012 servers okay create and it's created so we will go in windows 2012 server and we will start new scan so scanning and advance okay here we'll give uh, windows and domain 2012 scanning 2012 server domain okay so target is 192.168.100.102 verify again what is the ip address of our domain controller we will go ip config and the 100.102 okay so we will go here 100.102 secondly we have to give a credentials it's a windows and it's a password and uh, administrator okay administrator and the password is this and domain is home lab dot local okay so this is the home lab dot local so that's it and just go for plugins and in the plugins we will use windows microsoft this is other bulletins and other things about the LDAP and other versions. Uh, let's use uh, Windows first. And then the second we will choose uh, another one. Okay. And then user management also. This is the user management. Let's go for Windows first and then one by one we'll create three scans for different uh, vulnerabilities for all. If we check there is maybe some of our uh, other server base also. So let's check some more plugins here if we have anything related to Windows. Okay, no, these are the only three we can scan. So let's scan first Windows. Save. okay so if we go here this is another one i will create another one this is first and i will go for second also windows 2012 uh, second okay scanning and same 100.102 credential is windows password Twitter. Local. and now I will choose second plugin this one which is 1986 uh, and I will save and I'll create user management another one also you scan advance go windows 2012 uh, scan is third okay scanning. 
same target and uh, we will go credentials windows administrator lab.local and I will go for plugins the last one which is user management and I will do save so I have three type of scans now we have created so I will run one by one first this and when it's completed I will run the second one then it will be completed and then the third one so let's see uh, what kind of vulnerabilities we have in 2012 server and in the sense of domain controller so let's launch first one okay it started let us complete i will suggest you can run all the scan at a time but it's our target is only one uh, machine so i don't want to mess up uh, the nasus to go and on a one target three scans so if we have a multiple targets different different so we can do it but right now we have a one target so all three scan will be there so what I will do, I will do one when it's, this one is completed, I will start another one, then this one, when this one is completed, I will go the last one. And then when all three is completed, I'll come back to share the vulnerabilities with you guys. And then we will see what kind of uh, vulnerabilities there. So I will pause the video and I'll come back after completion of these three scans. Hi guys, so our I'm back, our all uh, three scanning, on Windows 2012 server domain controller is completed and let's see one by one first we will go in our first scan which we choose all the windows so I will go there wow and you can see here uh, like 21 critical 207 is high and the medium is 70 and 16 is low and uh, 224 is informatic so we have to bring all these to green so if you check 21 okay go there and all critics is related to patch <clears throat> sorry we have to upgrade all these patches on the win this uh, 2012 server and then also this one also related to patch so i'll go back go to the second also there is vulnerabilities okay smb servers so these all things you have to figure out one by one and uh, you know uh, to config, configure and read this vulnerability out which can help uh, to the hackers to hack your systems. So what I will do, uh, let's go the second one. How many is there? This was the first scan. We'll go on the second scan. Oh, there is also and it's similar to both. There will be a lot of common which the all scanning uh, they picked up like this one is same on the both scanning let's go on a user management which we use plugin for third one here 21 to 07 and there is also all similar lot of similar so what I will do I will go on my uh, domain controller and I have update uploaded up uh, I have uh, some downloaded some like updates update patches okay why am i okay sorry it was hang okay i have up downloaded some patches 2012 so what i will do i will uh, start running these one by one and when it's completed and then we will do a uh, scan again and let's see how many gone and then we'll see how many remains so right now it's like 21 this and 207 here uh which is more critical here also and if we go third one here also 21 and let let's uh, minimize this one and then uh, we'll do more so i will pause my video and then uh, when i'll install all these patches and i will do run again these all three scanner scannings uh so and i'll come back to join you guys okay guys uh, after domain controller uh, you know our domain controller is um, i have upgraded and then i have run the you know all the uh, scanning again so windows 2012 so let's see uh, what are the results as you know it was like uh, our 
when we scanned it was like 200 high and 21 criticals and see now 6 critical 25 and 29 so it's reduced so much so one by one you have to go on any critical and then the patches you have to download it will give you the advisory so microsoft has provided additional advisory so one by one what i did i have uh, gone through and uh, i have downloaded the patches which was required so like this here see these are the kb package kbs i have downloaded one by one and i have installed like this apply security only this patch or this cumulative update so like that i have downloaded and i have applied so it came from uh, you know 21 to 6 similar to our uh, second same one and then if we go on our third which is user one and this is also same so it's like all the uh, things we have to clean up one by one so our uh, domain controller windows 2012 server should be green all and uh, some of the blue informatic also you can read off so it should be all green then your server domain controller or 2012 server is safe and there is no much vulnerabilities so this was that was this was the video for about uh, how to scan uh, windows 2012 server with nessus so hopefully you like it and uh, if you like just press the like and uh, don't forget to subscribe my channel and uh, hit the bell icon for upcoming videos. So see ya next time. Take care. Bye bye.